Hi guys, so today we're going to talk about fighting and how girls fight, and this is exactly how girls fight. And there, and tips, sorry. Duh. Okay, tips. So, first of all is, people will always say, oh, pulling hair is a pussy move and all this. Um, no. The only thing that you should be worried about is winning. But me, I've only gotten into two fights. And I have one bowl. Oh, wait, I'm lying. No, it was three. No, four. Yeah, four. Okay, Brittany, Amanda, Destiny, and Mandy. Yeah. But Mandy, it wasn't really a fight. I just whooped her ass. Um, Destiny, same with Destiny. But with Amanda and Brittany, they, they actually fought back. So that was good. But I won all four of them. Okay. And I'm not gonna lie, I was I was really scared to fight Amanda, to be honest with you, because everybody said that she could fight, but then it ended up that she couldn't. So yeah, she made me draw my fries, dude, because she punched me in my arm. Awkward silence. Anyways, okay, so yeah, they said not to pull hair or whatever, but who cares if you pull hair? This is what I do. So my hair is down. Hold up, let me put it. Let me take it down. Uh. Alright, so usually some dumb bitch will put their, put their, like, hair, they'll leave it down or whatever. And if they do, don't say nothing about it, because you'll need it. So, this is what you're going to do. So, the hair's probably going to be like this. But, for me, when I had fought Destiny, um, what's it called? Little Destiny, Minion, 7th grader? Anyways, well... I got her from behind, and everyone's like, I don't think, I don't think it was a pussy move, I mean, because, you know, she didn't say shit. Okay, so I was like, I, like, you take your hands like this, like, and you just make your hands tangled in that, see so how, so you just tangle it in there, like that, and then you just hit her. Now, I just, okay, first of all, when you hit, okay, now we're going on to hitting. When you hit, oh my gosh, um, this right here, don't hit with this right here, because you will, it will, doesn't hurt, like, if you were to feel this, like, feel this, there's nothing even, like, touching it right there, like, it's just fat, pretty much, I think it's fat, I must look that up on Google, okay, so, but then right here, you have the bones, four of them, if you can't count, one, two, three, four, Okay, and then you also have buns right here, bun, buns, bones right here too. So, yeah. And I fight with this one. It's kind of hard for me to fight with this one. That's why I grab the hair and do that crap. But, okay. So, yeah. I will tell you the story about me and Destiny. Or, no, me and Mandy and Destiny. Because those are my two favorite fights ever. Um, okay, so when a girl, she'll automatically try to put your head down. And where your head is down in her stomach pretty much. So, this is what you do. Because most people can't walk, like, run backwards, you know? So this is what you do. You just, like, slam like this when you're down on her. And you pretty much, like, ram into her. Because she will eventually fall back. And you'll be, since you're right, say she's right here and you're, like, you're like this or whatever. If you do this or whatever and you go like that all the way into her, she'll end up falling. And then you'll be on top and then you can just keep on hitting her or whatever. So that's a good tip for y'all to do. So just ram into her and then try to hit her. And I know that y'all ain't really thinking about thinking about doing this or whatever, but try to remember, okay? And then another thing is tripping, okay? And I don't really know how to explain this. I'm not really about to get up and show y'all. But here's, okay, like, here's you. Here's you. Okay. Here's her. You're going to, okay, she's going to automatically try to trip you or make you fall. So you're just going to grab her leg and pull her down. Just so you can pull her down and you can, like, hit her. Because if not, then it'll just be, like, you know, you'll lose. So, yeah. Okay, so now let's get on to the story. Okay, so Minor Destiny's fight. This happened just yesterday. Yeah, just yesterday. That was my favorite fight ever. Oh, my God. Okay, so I, like, took her from behind and did with the thing with my hair or whatever. And she did... What? And 
and sorry guys and she tried to um I'm sorry it's dark but and my mom just called my name but anyways okay and so she tried to really ram really me and like I like rammed her where she was like over the pole or whatever and she's like short and plump she, I want to sh she's fat but she's not anyways okay I'm gonna have and like she like ran over the pole or whatever and so I got on top of her and I was just like beating her and Jacob never already had to pull me off of her so yeah anyways so that's what happened and then my new Mandy's fight she I just got tired of her talking shit so I just like tapped her on the shoulder dink hit her in her face and then um Parker had to pull me off of her honestly I am not one a big fighter I don't like to fight but if it has to then it will because I can only take so much of people talking shit about me I mean I do have a lot of haters like people are like oh no you're this and that like I have a lot of friends but yet I have a lot of haters you know hated by many loved by few known by all that's my saying like for real, I'm like known in the whole, in the whole school I'm not trying I'm not trying to be cocky or brag or anything but for real, like everybody knows me I want to say I'm the popular girl popular don't know how to talk but I'm popular enough that where everybody knows me and like the eighth graders are talking about me and I'm like even the sixth graders and I'm like yeah that's right but so like if they're talking like and I just want to y'all to know that if people are talking about you who cares I mean you must be doing something right for them for everybody to be talking about you and if they spread your rumors about you who cares stand up for yourself you know and I hate when people don't stand up for themselves because I do it my I do it for them so I just wanted to give you all those tips and I hope you like it. This is like my second video, my first account. I forgot the password, but I do. And it's um, what makes me happy, what makes me happy. And it's just like my face and I'm wearing a white Echo shirt. So y'all know that it all to me. And um, I just hope that y'all like it. And right now I'm about to do this thingy. Hold up. I want to show y'all. Ah, is it not going to work? You give them a, the bam, the bam, there you go. You, I was like so, so heated the other day, literally heated when I clawed her. She, she literally looks like a bull, like for real, she looks like a bull. And I'm waiting for the bull to come up here. Are you going to come? No, you don't want to come? Hmm. <laughs> It's not coming up. Oh well. But all I heard, she was just like, she started talking shit or whatever. She sounded like a freaking dumbass bird that wouldn't go away. And so I was just like, you know what? I just like started laughing like so hard. I just started laughing so hard, you know. And I was like, no, no, no. You ain't doing that to me. So I gave her a little bit of this. Oh, how to wait for it? Okay, these effects ain't working. They like, wow. But yeah. So I just wanted to give y'all that, and then so I just hope y'all like it, and yeah. Um, check out my video, subscribe, you know, do all that stuff. Bye. Remember YOLO and. The real meaning in a swag is she wants a gentleman. Truth is, are you a gentleman? So y'all just remember that, guys. And I hope y'all like it. So, yeah. And then YOLO, you only live once. And just because, yeah. Bye. Another kiss for you.